Where do these images come from? What is the relationship between these images and American foreign policy? America's love affair with Arabia reached a frenzy with The Shake, starring Rudolph Valentino. Because it was represented as a place where there was a lot of romance and excitement. What ended America's love affair with Arabia was actual contact. The British Empire invaded Egypt and Palestine. In the media, the Arabs, not the British, were the attackers. The mainstream media presents a rich diet of pictures of Palestinians blowing up targets in Israel. I was watching the news and Walter Cronkite said, Jerusalem has been liberated. It had been liberated from whom? What you do is you, you change and diminish the language of the conflict. The wall becomes the fence or the barrier. The occupied territories becomes disputed territories. The, ABC News. the television coverage of the Iranian hostage crisis dwarfed the coverage of the civil rights movement and even Vietnam. Day 13. It was the obsession of American television news for more than a year. The United States goes into the country promising democracy, freedom, liberation. And we see these very graphic images of what the American experience had come to. Somehow along the way there, we had produced the image of the beast human in Arab form.